Good morning, YouTube. It is Thursday. I am awake. That's uh, about all you're getting out of me right now because it was a very late night. But it was a good time. We um, we have a park in my small hometown where they usually have vendors and food trucks and then that's where they do the um, the fireworks at the end of the day. So we, uh, I told you that my, my friend, my cousins and my family came in from Texas and she's a really big family. And so um, we all went to the parade with her and the kids and people kept throwing us candy and we're like, okay, let's put it in this bag because none of us are eating it. And um, so, I mean, that was fun. It was nice to see them. And then I went and I got to hang out with my sister for a little bit while everyone took naps, except us. And um, and then I came home and grabbed my husband and then we went back to the park and went to um, enjoy just the, uh, the fireworks. Sorry. Woo. Okay, there we go. Okay, sorry. Um, so what else? Uh, we didn't eat a whole lot. We had already decided we weren't eating there. We did go to um, Brahms. Brahms. Yeah, we went to Brahms and we had, um, I had the triple cheese with uh, lettuce and pickles. Without the bread, of course. And you know, it's always so funny when you're around people that aren't keto. I was like, oh, you can't eat this, you can't eat that. We have one aunt that's super skinny, very healthy. And she just, it's its almost like she can't accept where, what we're doing. And so she ends up asking the questions over and over again about, um, oh no, you can't eat deer. Oh, where can you eat? What are you gonna do? Oh no, blah, blah, blah. And, and it's hilarious, you know, it's whatever. That my my mom and my sister get so frustrated because they're like, we have told you that every place serves meat, and that's all we really have to have. Eat fat, blah blah blah. You know, but it's just you know watching people's reactions to to our way of eating is always interesting because you know I mean and really everyone's reaction to it, but her reaction especially because she is so skinny and 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 I've never in my entire life seen her overweight. She's always been the size that she is. So, you know, her way of eating works very, very good for her. But, uh, you know, we're not all like that. And she's very active. So, you know, she's, she's just different. So, it's just, it's interesting because everyone tends to judge and want to believe that their way is the best way. You know, and I mean, we are, we're the same way with, with the keto. And so, um... It doesn't promote a whole lot of tolerance, but it does at the same time. You know, I mean, I know from from watching videos and from listening to responses on Facebook and stuff that there are, of course, ketoers out there that only believe in their way and want to mock and ridicule anybody that doesn't do it their way. But I think that's people in every walk in, of life and society, you know what I mean? But, um... I was gonna also tell you that uh, my husband and I were talking this morning and he they told you that he was gonna do keto but he hasn't really started he's been thinking about it kind of working that way and um, he watches Joe Rogan he watches him on uh, YouTube and he watched a, a special about the carnivore diet which I mean I, I don't know for sure but it sounds like it's pretty close to keto and that's what he wants to look up and I said you know if there's anything I've learned on this diet, it's that every single person is different. Every body is different. Everyone's genes are different. And so, you know, what works for me may not work for you. But I said, just make sure that you do the research. And, and I would love for you to compare it to keto because I know from experience that this diet works quite well. Thank you. So, um, he's going to do that and, and do some research and get back to me and tell me like what the, what the comparisons are and stuff. So we'll see how that goes.
Well, it's really weird to be gone in the middle of the week because now I still have two more days and Saturday, so I guess two and a half days. So, here we go. I guess two short weeks, so it's kind of what it's feeling like, you know? But I'm gonna get in there, I'm gonna get to work. Thanks for watching, y'all have a great rest of the week.